Good morning, friends. It's 7.30 in the morning. I'm in Washington, D.C. I uh, just uh, spent the night coming up from South Carolina on uh, train 98, uh, the train from Miami to uh, New York. So we're at, I'm going to just take a walk, walk the platform, uh, show the contents of the train. Uh, the last car is the baggage car. And we're going to be here about a half an hour. They're going to take the two diesel engines off the train and put on an electric. Uh, and during that time, here's an electric uh, uh, pulling a train into the station on uh, the next track over. But during that time, the power's off, so uh, it's time to you know stretch the legs. Um, even uh, go up to the station to get something uh, if you're quick. So it looks like they're getting ready to unload the baggage uh, right here. And we're just gonna uh, start walking up the platform. Now I think we're about an, a little over an hour late leaving uh, uh, Charleston, South Carolina. And I think we made up some time during the night. I'm not sure, but I think we were supposed to arrive here at 7.30. And it is 7.30, and we're here in Washington Union Station. Uh, the next car up for the baggage car is a sleeper. And there's two types of sleepers. They, they look kind of the same from the outside. Um, uh, Viewliner 1, Viewliner 2. The Viewliner 2s are the newer ones. The Viewliner 1s of the older ones, I'm not sure what this one is, the one I was in was one of the older ones. And those have the, uh, the toilet in the room, all the rooms have a toilet. So we get, uh, get out of the way here. Um, people waiting for a red caps to take them up to the uh, station. So this, uh, the, second, the second sleeper is a Viewliner 2. And these ha do have the toilets in the bathroom. Uh, the other cars have public restrooms at the end of the cars, the, uh, the Viewliner 1. I'm sorry, this is the Viewliner 1, the older one. Viewliner 2s don't have the bathrooms in the rooms, in the small rooms, they do in the large rooms. So we have two, we have two sleepers on this train, usually there's three, but maybe a little bit of off-season, I'm not sure. This is the diner. And right now it will be closed because there's be no power when they take the engines off. And when they put the electric on, power will be restored. And when I reboard, I will go for my breakfast. And here come the, uh, the baggage truck and cart. So these four cars, the, the baggage car, the uh, the Viewliner sleeper, two sleepers, and the Viewliner diner all have a similar look. And then after that is the Amfleet, and these cars are approaching uh, 50 years old, and they will be replaced uh, probably with it over the next five years, maybe sooner. This is a cafe car. I can tell uh, because there's this big gap here that doesn't have any windows. There's three windows, then a wall and two windows. So that's the cafe car. Okay, get some activity going on here. And this is a Amfleet coach. And these, these are old, but they're comfortable. Uh, the new ones will have larger windows. This might be an Amfleet 2, I, which are uh, used on the long distance trains. This is Amfleet 1, Amfleet 2. Amfleet 2 are a little bit newer, but still approaching uh, 45, 50 years old. So this is the second Amfleet Coach. So we have an Amfleet Cafe. And Amfleet Coach 
and then the first car is also an Infleet coach. So three Infleet coaches and an Infleet cafe car, and then four fuel liner cars. So the consist is eight cars. We had two diesels. We're walking up to them now. They'll be taking these these off here. And we'll go under the wire, you can see the wire, up to New York. Friends, that's the consist. Uh, you can see uh, engine 48 is a little bit, uh, the paint's a little bit beaten up, but uh, to get us up here, no problem. I did clock us when we left Charleston, uh, South Carolina, we were going about 77. I think the, the, the speed restriction or the, or the speed limit is 79. Now, when we, when we head up to New York, the speed limit uh, is much higher on the track. Um, I'm not sure what the limit is for the sleepers. Uh, normally, they'd be doing, I would say, 125. I don't know if we'll go that that high. If it was just the amp fleets and uh, under the electric power, it would be about 125. Across the platform, we see some uh, Maryland uh, commuter rail cars. Uh, I have ridden on these, these uh, bi-level coaches. Very nice ride. Uh, so anyone that wants to take a short trip, uh, I'd recommend taking the, uh, the, the, the Mark, the Maryland commuter rail down between Baltimore and Washington. Uh, there's two routes from Baltimore, one's from the Camden Yards area, a different route into uh, Union Station. A nice little rail planning trip. And here goes the uh, one of the engineers up into the cab. And here come a, uh, here come a bunch of guys that will... Nope. I thought they were... Uh, Workers, but they are uh, helping some uh, passengers off the train. Not sure where they're going. Maybe. Maybe they have to cross the platform to uh, go to another platform to get them onto an elevator. There are escalators at this platform. I don't think they're. I don't. I didn't see any elevator, so I think that's where they're going. I've never really seen this done before, but they may have to cross uh, a few tracks. There are high-level platforms uh, on the other side of these, uh, on this mark train. Yeah, here goes another golf cart full of uh, people needing uh, assistance up to the station. And I see them down the end there. It looks like, oh, uh, there, there he goes. I don't, I don't know if you can see it. They're crossing the tracks. Wow, they're kind of bumping along there. It looks like they have to cross like four tracks. Maybe more. I guess they're going to the high level platforms where uh, the access to the station, uh, they can avoid taking the escalator. So that's how it's done here. So this is a beautiful station, uh, worth a tour in itself. And above us, I want to say, and I probably get this wrong. I think this is Eighth Street above us, and that is there's a streetcar that runs uh, on that on that street 
it's not that long, maybe a mile, a mile and a half at that. But anyways, that's another little trip you can take. It's, it's all street running. It is very slow because uh, cars uh, kind of park and block it and they might have to send a tow truck out to move the cars. But it, it's a nice little trip you have the time. The H Street uh, streetcar. Anyways, friends, um, that about wraps it up. I hope you're having a good morning and I uh, hope to see you in the next video. If you like it, please subscribe, like, and share. Take care, friends. God bless.